Weekend returns in a couple of minutes. Now, some Houston news. For Vietnam veteran Tom Fossing, this ride at Manville's Habitat for Horses represents more than a leisurely trot. It's another trip in a life-changing journey. I had a lot of animosity towards the feel, military Tom? nowadays because everybody's doing everything for them and we were shunned, called everything you could think of. And I had a lot of anger with the horse. It calms that anger. We've done rescue work, working with law enforcement for not only in Galveston County, but pretty much all over the state of Texas and various places around the United States. One of the things we've always wanted to do is be able to utilize these kind of animals in the therapy programs involving people. This is enabled when we moved here with the enclosed barn, we're finally able to do that. So how does therapeutic horseback riding work? I take the clinical part of the therapy and I combine that with the therapeutic um, aspects of a horse. A lot of the things that the horses do, they mirror back what humans are feeling. So if the human is feeling stressed, the horse is gonna mirror that back. What we notice when they're tense, I'll t tell them to be mindful of your coping skills. You know, lower the breathing, relax. So if I can get them to kind of be aware of their self, then the horse is gonna mirror that back and there'll be a calmness. And for Fossing, the therapy has changed his entire outlook. They say um, you could fall in love with a horse. You can, you really can. They give you all of themselves. They don't judge you. I mean, I never let myself get close to anybody. <clears throat> and through Bella, I've started to realize that things aren't as bad as I thought they were all the time. For Houston Public Media News, I'm Edel Howlin. Now back to PBS News.